Western food is taking over Hong Kong. This is the preparation time. It's not the performance time yet, <laughs> but it's okay. Let's get ready within this one minute. If you are done with your preparation, you can raise your hand. Let student number one raise his or her hand. Western food is taking over Hong Kong. Something big needs to change. The food president of Hong Kong has decided to send dim sum, a chart and pineapple bun on a world adventure to try and sell their treats to other parts of the world. No, no way, dim sum. I'm not going to New York with you and egg tart. Oh, don't be so dramatic, pineapple bun. We have to go. We need to show the rest of the world what Hong Kong treats they are missing out on. And we also need to show the food president that we have the guts to take on the challenge. But I'm scared, egg tart. I've never left Hong Kong before. Oh, come on, pineapple bun. Let's take the initiative. We can see it as an adventure and we get to travel to amazing places. First stop is New York. I've wanted to go there all my life. Okay, okay, I will go with you. But please, don't leave me alone out there. We stick together always, yes? Yes. Of course. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Ooh, New York, here we come. Okay, let's set up a store quickly and we can introduce our yummy and delicious foods to the people here. Relax, Pineapple Bun. It will all be fine. Hot dim sum at your servers. We have all flavors. Veggie and meat, sweet and savory. Something for everyone. Come on over and taste these succulent treats. Hey, dim sum. I don't think anyone has noticed us yet. Well, that is because you keep hiding, Pineapple Bun. You need to brave up and start shouting over at people. Yes, Pineapple Bun, just like this. <clears throat> Come get your egg tarts here. The new delicious treats all the way from Hong Kong. These are delicious, sweet and crunchy. Two for a price of one. Only one dollar for two tarts. Come now before they all run out. Ooh, hey, if you want to sell Hong Kong cheese, you should go to Chinatown. Chinatown? What are you all doing here? Hello, man. We were sent over here to share our Hong Kong trees to the, to the rest of the world. Look at this golden custard egg tart with a distinctive cookie crust. Oh my, I can smell its mouth away. Also, please try this crunchy and sweet crust, which is like the pattern of pineapple skin. Underneath, it is a fluffy and soft bun, which comes with either a custard or red bean filling. My mouth is already watering. Oh, look at those buns in the bamboo basket. Oh, these are delicious. I highly recommend this soft and tasty bun with sweet and tender pork inside. My favorite one is this deep fried shrimp dumplings. The shrimp is wrapped in dough and deep fried until it turns a golden yellow. Crispy outside, juicy inside. Whoa, these really are delicious. Yes, but we were down at the harbor for the whole day yesterday and nobody would buy us. One kid even said I was disgusting. Oh dear, Tart, you are not disgusting. In fact, I know that all my friends would be dying to see all three of you and eat you up. So, what are we waiting for? Let's start our business right here, right now. Yes, let's! I won't find one here and a half for today. Two please, testing, testing. Hi guys, we are so glad that you all like our food. Thank you for traveling here today. However, I'm sorry to announce, everything is sold out. We'll start selling tomorrow at 7 a.m. Hope to see you soon. Aww. Yay. Yay! Welcome home, our heroes. Mr. Dim Sum, Mr. Eggtart, and Miss Pineapple Bun. Do you have a minute to tell the public how you feel about your marvelous trip on promoting Hong Kong food worldwide? Yes, of course. 
We are proud of a year long journey. Now, everyone in the world knows a bit more about Hong Kong traditional snacks, where we are determined enough to get ourselves out there. Nothing is impossible. I would like to say a special thank you to my travel mates for making me come. Without that extra push to realize, with a little courage, I would never have had this amazing experience. On top of that, we enjoyed learning different languages when we were traveling. And yes, they are. People in South Korea were loving us there. My favorite was Japan. Konnichiwa. The people were amazing and so polite. I can't believe we ran out of snacks there. Well, at least our food president will be proud of us and all the hard work we did. Not only him, we are all very proud of you. We love Lisa! We love Hong Kong! Kowloon, Kowloon, Hong Kong We like Hong Kong